Hi there. Let's take another look at the rocking thumb roll. In, once you've got uh, you're comfortable with the three, two, five, one changing chords and so on, what you'd want to do next is build in the fourth string and alternate with that with the third string. So what you would do is a three, two, five, one, and then a four, two, five, one, and a three, two, five, one, and a four, two, five, one. In other words, you'll have this. And then, in the same way, switch your chords. What that's going to allow you to do is add more variety to a song, and as well, it's going to allow you to start playing the melodies, which is a one of the reasons we want to play the banjo, we want to sing with it, but we also want to play leads and, and melodies. So here's an example of singing that same song I did earlier, but now I'm going to go from string to string. You gotta walk that lonesome valley. You gotta walk it by yourself. Ain't nobody here gonna walk it for you. Now, you know, I wasn't perfect on <laughs> that one. Not that I'm not always, but, but um, a couple of times I did a couple of three, two, five ones in a row and, and so on. But, but basically, I'm aiming to do a three, two, five one and then a four, two, five one and, and build that in the song just for a nice interest, that background to your song. All right? Try that next. 